station Take a ride on the skyline Roll out, get with it Alright, so since I created my bucket list, I definitely put a lot more focus on creating those lasting memories. With all the videos I share with you here on this channel, I'm trying to inspire you to also go after your goals, to experience those memorable moments that write the stories that you will tell when you're old. As a quick recap, here are the items from my bucket list that I was able to tick off in 2021. So before we get into the video, I would love to hear about your top memory from 2021. Just let me know down below in the comments with a few sentences or words. I will wait. Well, yeah, that's it. So let me show you where we are. We are currently in the Netherlands and we're actually staying in one of those houseboats. And we're here to reflect on the year. That's why I'm making this video, so I can tell you a little bit more about what I experienced this year. But more importantly, we are here to think about the goals for 2022. What is it that I want to achieve next year or this year? Because by the time you're watching this video, it's already 2022. Let's get into it. One of the most exciting bucket list items that I accomplished this year is definitely the skydiving license. Yes, I am allowed to jump on my own out of an airplane. Another really intense goal that I accomplished this summer was to drive off-road through Iceland. All right, there's another river that we have to cross. There's actually a video in progress and I hopefully will be able to share with a few guys very soon. Playing a complete song on the piano was something that I always wanted to do. So this was a really difficult task, but earlier this year or earlier last year, I managed to do so by playing piano every day for 30 days and I managed to play a complete song. Alright, so I'm standing in front of our houseboat. Let me give you a little tour. I first gonna walk around it. Um, this place must be really cool in summer, but maybe I'm gonna jump into the water in a little bit, because you know, why not? So this is our bedroom. Nice view onto the water. Then, right here, we got Romina. <laughs> not here. And this is the living room. This is where we reflect, as you can see, post-its everywhere. If you remember, two years ago, I was in Croatia, I did the same, um, even crazier, but I'm gonna insert a time-lapse here, how I did it. Here is how our plans get created. Yeah, let's go outside again. Wait, I need shoes. I forgot my shoes, I forgot my shoes. Bye. <laughs> Woo. Storm, stormy, stormy, stormy. Well, let me tell you about Dubai. So in May, we were in Dubai for one week, which was a really intense week. And we accomplished several goals from myself, from others, and from strangers that we met on the street. Like we helped someone to accomplish its bucket list goal to go skydiving. What we did is we literally went around on the streets to ask people about their bucket list goals. Yeah, skydiving. Skydiving? Yeah. Okay, let's do yeah. it. Really? Yeah. The items that were on my bucket list was number one, to do a backflip on a jumbo jet. Well, it wasn't really a jumbo jet, but it was a really big jet, so I thought, yeah, it counts. And actually within the same minutes, I also accomplished another goal, which was to do a backflip inside of an airplane. Did you see that? I just spit it. Then there was actually a third goal, which was to drive a supercar on a racetrack. I drove a Ferrari, 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 around a racetrack. 
it felt like a video game, but it was such a cool experience. Oh yeah, and also Pontus wanted to jump from a shipwreck. There were actually two shipwrecks that we visited, but we still weren't able to manage to tick off that item. Uh, if you want to see more details about that, just go and watch the, the full video. But in August, I actually was in Cyprus and the locals took me to a shipwreck there and I jumped from the top. There's actually a lot of content that hasn't been seen yet, so stay tuned because there's so much more coming this year. I need to go inside, it's kind of fresh here. Actually, let's see how warm the water is. Hmm. Well, so for sure I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna jump into the water here. And we're gonna plan like a little follow run where Romina follows me through the house and I'm gonna jump through the window here, like literally through the window, no, through the open door into the water. Okay, this is ready. And I am ready to. Well, so today we're actually going to do a Wim Hof workshop. So we're staying in this little winter pot and there's an ice bath right next to it. So it's perfect. Also, the weather is perfect. Uh, it's raining. It's the perfect weather to do that, right? So we're going to learn the proper breathing techniques and then, of course, going to take a dip in the ice bath and going to learn all the techniques from Wim. Well, we're not doing the workshop with the legendary Iceman himself, but with a certified instructor of him. This is Kim, and the stories she told us about Wim were just very inspiring. Touched when the first time I met him, I saw this heartwarming Iceman. We then already drifted into deep conversations and set our intention for the session. Stop to think because we're just not only thinking human beings. Yeah, we are human that. beings, not human doings. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good yeah. one. That's a good one. <laughs> then it was time to breathe. Kim took care of us so well and guided us through this session. And afterwards, we literally dove so deep into conversations about the experiences that we had. Opened my eyes and it was like seeing the world for the first time again. I have this really big vision of impacting 10 million people in my lifetime to live a fulfilling life. It's a huge task and Clarity is the most, or the single most important thing that I need for this, to accomplish it. Mm -hmm. Losing yourself at one point, you are kind of in another world. And then there comes the point when consciousness is back and you are here again and you just don't know where you've been. I, I feel like everyone should just create memories that will last. Mm -hmm. So this is like the mission done that I'm on. Mm -hmm. uh, because I, it's really, it's painful for me to hear when someone is like, ah, I'm too old now to do this. So it's like, why not doing it? Why not doing it now? If someone wants to do something, but something holds them back, what would you tell them? If there's no rehearsal, <laughs> there's this one option. Yeah, yeah. once, really, once you're gone, you're yeah. gone. Knowing that there's only this one really becoming aware that you are fucking alive. Mm -hmm. It's time for the ice bath. You surrender to all the sensations and everything you feel is a sign that your body is protecting you. I'm working hard. Long breath out. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. She said maximum two minutes, not minimum. <laughs> <laughs> Long breaths out.
talking about ice baths, in February I accomplished another bucket list item by staying in ice water for 10 minutes. Yes, love it! day of 2021 we are currently in Amsterdam the place where you can smell weed at every corner yeah we got ourselves some bicycles and we are about to explore the city and look who just landed next to you a pigeon Check it out. by the way I also always wanted to do a backflip on a bike or with a bike which I managed to do just recently, actually. Send it. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I'm also gonna make a video about this very soon. Oh wow, it's crazy. Oh, we only got three hours left of 2021. So another cool thing that I've done in Cyprus was a underwater photo shooting. And probably one of the coolest things I've done this year was sliding down the Europeans' biggest sand dunes in France. <laughs> wow! All right, another bucket list item off the list. Yes! A hell of a lot has happened in 2021, but this was just the beginning. 2022 will be the year we launch the Bucket List app that goes by the name of Tues. With this will come a great opportunity for you to plan your goals and go after them. What do you want to achieve in this year? What are your future memories that you want to create? I wish you all the best for 2022 and I know that you can make this one your best year yet. I'll see you in the next one.